Hello, 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 everybody! Praise be to God, and welcome back to another episode of uh, Harvest Moon 64. That's the name of the game. As you can see, last episode, our kid grew up. It's awesome. Today, we will be looking forward to some exciting horse race adventures on the 14th day of winter, and, well, some other stuff. You'll just have to wait and see. <laughs> keep, tuned, <laughs> keep this station tuned in. Pooh? This is, um, a dog, not Winnie the Pooh. So one thing I am going to try, it just to see if the L.E. Poppery cutscene I did miss, I'm gonna try entering that screen when it's night. Just to, just to check to see if it has to be night in order for the scene to trigger. Let's try it. Never mind. Woohoo! It was a good fishing day today. I caught, like, five or six big fish. Oh, that was wonderful. Yeah, wait here, you guys see this. Yeah, look at that! Look at this haul! No, oh, my cake! Actually, that was my son's cake. Don't worry, son, I've got a replacement in the refrigerator. Actually, the freezer. Frozen cake is legit. It's quite good. Oh, but now, we, we, because my wife and kids spawn at the exact same point, I have to wait for them to separate before I can hand out the presents. When is the dog race? I thought it was on the 14th. Oh, so at this point, I have too much stuff in my inventory to drop this. And I literally have no choice but to just wait out the clock down here. La la la, this is a blue rock. Okay, there we go. <laughs> We're done for the day, come again tomorrow. Maybe. Man, I got a, a lot of blue rocks and a lot of pentata roots, and that is it. There were a few iron ores, but I just tossed them, because those are not worth it. Quite a few coins as well. So I think I'll sell most of this stuff, but I'll leave one of each. One for Saibara, the other for the potion shop dealer. I've only been sick a few times in my whole life. Well, good for you, the potion shop dealer. I'm glad your immune system is strong. I consider myself to have a pretty strong immune system. But I, that doesn't mean I've only been sick a few times. My cup overfloweth with fish. Hey! Hey, we're holding the dog race tomorrow at the racetrack. Why don't you enter Rory? I'll enter. Good, I'll register for you, and I'll get your dog ready in the morning. Well, goodbye. See you later. This is my last opportunity to win the dog race, so... We better do well. Hopefully it won't be as hard to win as the horse race, because I know I won it on my first try, but it was close. I was pretty sure I had lost that race. Well, that was a productive day. I caught zero fish. I only had three bites, and I missed them all. Dog race 2018, engage! Ooh, I like these odds. I need to get close to 3,000 medals by the end of this day because I only have one more horse race after this, and at the end of that horse race, I need to have 3,000 medals to get the last prize. I didn't know Karen was racing. I didn't know Karen was a dog. But of course I'm rooting for Marin, because he's the underdog. <laughs> Let me in. There's nobody here. First dog race is about to start, Wolf. Get ready. Come on, White Scarf. White Scarf, come on, White Scarf. Darn it, I think Green Scarf won. Still, I get close to 300 medals for that. Results are in. First place, Koshi. Yep. Second place, Marin. Darn it! I almost ran away with a ton of medals.
Almond. Ooh, these are even better odds. Oh, Taro is racing? Really? Taro is the potion shop dealer's dog. All the dogs ran very hard. They did a good job. They were very cute. Aw. It's better when you buy a ticket, isn't it? Oh, Artie, good afternoon. It's pretty exciting, eh? When you show affection to your animals, they respond to it. Gosh, I went wrong again. The dogs are all so cute. Shall we have our Baron participate next time? See, I told you to take that one. I'll win next time. Wah, wah, wahoo! Oh no, I can't get any more medals. Hmm, if I lost, it's pretty difficult to anticipate. You haven't lost yet, your dog's racing this time. They were all fast! You know, dogs can run fast if you cherish them. I don't think that's how that works. I wonder what the Moo Moo watch prize is like. They all were running so hard, it was cute! Alright, doggies. I'm rooting for Taro. The second race is about to start. Get ready. <laughs> okay, the second dog from the top is the one I want to win. There are two identical looking dogs, and the one that's falling behind is Taro. Man, good luck for green scarfs today, I guess. They've reached the finish line, folks. The results are first place Chaco, second place Johi. Oh, yes! Wonderful. I don't have to bet anymore. I'm still, of course, going to try. But it's going to be Kiri participating. Participants are not allowed to buy tickets. Lame. Worst kind of case scenario, I can type in a game shark code to give him higher affection. The third race is about to start. Temporary save state there. Get ready. I think it's just luck based. I don't think I have any outcome on this race. Come on, Rory. Nope, Rory didn't win. They've reached the finish line. I wonder if there's a special cutscene if you lose. The results are first place Kuri, second place Wonder. I got third place. Darn it. And that was the times 24 one too. That was the last race of the day. Please go exchange your medals for gifts. Nope, nobody says anything different. My dog is going to win. Get ready. So even if your dog's at max affection, it's still not a guaranteed thing. It's totally luck-based. That's not very good. Not even close. And here's the thing, if you weren't playing on, like, Project 64, you would have to reset the console and play the entire game again every time you lost. Maybe it is a tap A fan. It didn't say so. I don't think I won. I think I came in third again. The results are first place Maple, second place Aguisu. Stupid Uguisu. It's not a tap A fan. Can you put some bacon at the end for my dog? Oh, that stupid white dog pulled ahead at the last second, I think. Just like I did at the horse race. You can't beat me, I'm a Time Lord. I have powers over the time-space continuum. Every time I lose, I just reset.
Man, my dog must have really low odds to win. Here we go. There we go. Now I finally won. And it only took like 20 resets. The results are first place Rory, second place Kako. Good boy. Congratulations, Artie. Rory ran a great race. Doug, hey, watch it up. You did it! Congratulations! Well, let's take a photo to commemorate the day. Are you ready? Say cheese. I'll send you the picture later. Hmm, you do that. Woot. Times 46! <laughs> no wonder I had to reset so much. Why couldn't I have bet on my own dog? If that was the last race of the day, please go exchange your medals for gifts. You did a good job. You did a good j. Rory is very fast. I was surprised. Hang on. You did a good j. Okay, it says job, and then it overwrites that. <laughs> it was very fast. Okay, hang on. Did it say Rory is very fast, and then that changed it as well? Yes, it did. <laughs> I guess that's what happens if you have too much text to fit into one box. That is hilarious. It's better when you buy a ticket, isn't it? Why well, couldn't it buy a ticket? Oh, RD, good afternoon. It's pretty exciting, eh? Is my wife the only one who's going to congratulate me? <laughs> you bet on the wrong dog. Do I talk? Nope, I'm not gonna talk to the post job dealer. If he says something different, I still don't wanna see his creepy face. Yep, only my wife congratulated me. Thank you, my wife. Hi, welcome! Please enjoy yourself. I'm not buying anything. I've got all the medals I need. This wraps up the day. We'll do it again next winter. Thanks for coming. I'm not going next winter. It was a big day. Take Rory home and get some rest. So that wins the dog race. One of the last exciting things left in this game. Now I don't get to flaunt my time powers anymore. This also means I don't have to take care of my dog anymore. I'm going to, just in case it plays a role in the evaluation at the end. We'll send you a souvenir picture and look forward to your actions in the future. Oh yeah, that's the dog race photo. We gotta check it out right now! Winner at the dog race. My dog's face looks kind of derpy in that photo. <laughs> oh well, it's fine. Honey, honey, it's bad. He has a high fever. What should I do? Oh, I've never had this happen before. Uh, let's call your mom. It's just the measles. Don't worry. Soon he'll break out in a rash and his fever will break. Oh, thank goodness. Just take care. Call any time you need help. Now you should get some rest. Oh, okay. Well, apparently my baby's back to being... <laughs> back to his normal self. <laughs> wow, I actually... I've never seen that before. I wonder what would have happened if I had selected one of the other people. I'm sure there's a YouTube video up there that shows it. Well, that was a terrible day in the mines. The only thing I found were iron ore, two moonlight stones, and a whole bunch of coins. I didn't even find the entrance to the second floor of the mine. And I went early, too. Some days just are just like that, you know?
Just gotta make the most of them. Ooh, it's cold! I can't stand the cold! Because I was born in midsummer? Well, that's certainly possible. <laughs> oh my. I wonder what Ouija thought about that. I'm like, I'd like a piece of cake. He's like, okay, I immediately throw it on the floor. Mmm, delicious! I gotta stock up on a ton of cake for my kid. He has quite the sweet tooth. Just like his dad. Actually, I'm not sure... What? How much is Jack uh, eaten, honestly, in this game? I mean, he eats donuts every morning, but I haven't made him eat pretty much anything else for the entire game. And man, Karen has just disappeared. Oh, sure, it's easy to catch stuff when you have a nearly full inventory. Holy cow. Apparently having a, some items in your inventory is the way to catch fish easily. Pretty sure I have the fisherman evaluation now. It's like the winter is the time to prepare things. As if plants, insects, even people are slowly gathering energy. Words of wisdom, Maria, here, have a cabbage. Well, today's the Star Night Festival, so... I forget what happens tonight. I don't need to go to my refrigerator freezer. All cats do is sleep. It's so boring. They're not sleeping now. Look, they're awake. And they are adorable. Wow, the midwife goes to bed early. <laughs> it's what, like... It was like 4.30 when I knocked on the door. <laughs> well, Star Night Festival's coming up, so... My wife's not coming in from the farm. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Oh. <laughs> I didn't notice. <laughs> Honey, let's go to the Star Night Festival tonight. Okay, I'll do my best. Hey, brother, did you come to listen to the performance? No, no, stay here a little longer. I want to talk to Stu. Okay, wow. Um, nice collision detection there. I literally can't talk to Stu. Sorry, Stu. Oh, good evening. It's always fine on the Star Night Festival. It's a beautiful starry sky. The Star Night Festival is a chance to pray on the night with the most beautiful stars of the year. That's nice. Oh, you came! It's going to start soon, and I'm so nervous I can't calm down. Good evening. We're, we'll all be playing together. Please listen. I'll try my best at the performance. Please listen. Of course I will. Hello! Good evening! May the, we begin the performance? Yes. I, the most eligible bachelor in town, the king of town, say we can start. Please sit back and enjoy. This is such an adorable ceremony. And that's my wife playing the organ back there. I never noticed the little bride and groom statue in the back. That's really cute. Or maybe that's the harvest goddess. It looks like a bride and groom to me. Honey, let's go to pray to the stars. That, I'm not gonna do. I can pray to God, not to the stars. <sighs> the stars will not answer. Beautiful sky, isn't it? I hope that everyone is happy. Aww. You don't get to share a romantic smooch under there? That's a bit disappointing. 
the baby started to crawl now, so I have to watch it all the time. I mean, he started to crawl a while ago. I am so glad I can give my baby gifts now. Ooh. Part of me really wants to finish winter in this video. And, like, I'm like, well, I probably could relatively easily. It would just mean spending a lot of time on it. <laughs> and at the same time, I'd be left, even after editing, with a pretty lengthy video. We'll see. There's also a ton of festivals right at the end. You know what day it is today, folks? It's Raffle Day! I can finally do the flower shop lottery because I have 30 free points. My family has run this flower shop for three generations now. Boom. Hi, you have enough stickers on the card. Do you want to draw a lottery card? Draw. Here, third prize, a flower sticker. Put it on your calendar. Yeah, so that basically gives me extra stickers for my calendar. Fourth prize is Catman Seeds. Second prize... That's <laughs> a BOOF agent! It's supposed to say bath agent, and the first prize is a cushion. Congratulations, you won second prize! Flower bath crystals! Relax in the bathtub! Oh yeah! <laughs> oh sorry, a blank, but here are some moondrop seeds for you to plant. No. I want first prize. Congratulations, you won first prize, a flower fragrant cushion! Have sweet dreams! That was the one I really wanted to get year one, but I was unable to because of stupid reasons. As you can see, we also have flower bath crystals here. Freshens you up. I think that makes you recover slightly more stuff when you take a bath if you have that in your inventory. And then the cushion, I think, refills more stamina for every hour you sleep. It's very nice. Hello, <laughs> Married, but nothing has changed. Okay. Hi, you have enough stickers on the card. Do you want to draw? Yes. Sorry, it's a blank, but here are some cookies. Have some when you get hungry. Okay, my son will love those. And I still have enough stickers for another draw. Aw, well, more cookies, that's fine. Hey, I got the special honey! That's awesome. And in the nick of time, too, because I no longer have stuff to draw. Hey, dude. Oh, thank you. I'm glad. Your milk tastes great. The year will end soon. It went by so fast. Not really. I feel like year two in this dragged on more than year one, even though it's completely untrue. I really want the other bachelorettes to have their kids soon. Hey, Karen, it's been a while. Let's try out our new bath crystals, shall we? First, we're gonna use the bathroom, though. Aww, you don't even, like, take them out or anything. I don't know what I expected, but I didn't expect that. And boom! Check it out! Flower cushion on our bed. That's going to make for some comfy sleep in it. And, of course, cuddling. And that's all the time that we have for this episode. We only have five days of winter left. Five days of year two. And then year three will come around and be over super fast. And then we'll finally be done with this Let's Play. Thank you all so much for watching up to this point. I'm Colorful Artie. I hope to see you for the next episode. In the meantime, have a great day, and God bless.